Horses are protected by the good Lord and a gun. And you might meet them both if you show up here, not welcome, son. Hi, I'm Jamie Franks here for Gun Guy Gear. Today I'm going to talk to you about something that's near and dear to my heart that really should be common knowledge, but the more I talk to gun owners, the more I'm actually finding out that it isn't. Um, first of all, let me get your attention by telling you that if you own a handgun in your home and you do not have it secured, in a hard-sided lock container with controlled access, you are a very irresponsible and negligent person that's going to get somebody killed. The days of keeping your handgun locked in your uh, your top sock drawer, you know, underneath your underwear, those days should be long over with. Everybody that owns a handgun in their home should have a hard-sided, lockable, controlled access container. You're still going to need access to your handgun in an emergency, so you don't want to get too crazy and put too many locks on it, but it needs to be locked somewhere or you're going to get somebody killed. This is what I believe to be the best product on the market today for keeping your handgun safely stored in your home with access to it at a moment's notice. If you go to Walmart or your neighborhood gun store, you may be familiar with like the Gun Vault brand. You may have seen those. Uh, you probably recognize it has the big rubber handprint thing on top of it where you stick your hand in it and punch in a physical type uh, cipher lock combination. Or you might have seen the uh, stack on little lock boxes. Uh, quite honestly, those are made out of pretty flimsy sheet metal and it requires a physical key that can be lost or stolen or misplaced or, or dropped and it takes that little key going into a little hole to unlock it and uh, gain access to your firearm. Uh, this is a biometric pistol safe by LockSafe Biometric and this one uses your fingerprints to open the safe. It's pre-programmable with up to 10 fingerprints with a non-volatile memory meaning if the battery goes dead or whatever it's not going to lose its memory. Um, it takes a standard 9 volt battery. It'll give you a low battery indication when the battery is getting low so the battery doesn't go dead and you don't know about it. It's a little bit bigger than a shoebox. It's 14 inches long by 10 and a half and about 5 inches high. It's made out of 9 gauge 3 millimeter steel and it weighs about 23 pounds. This is a hefty piece of equipment. The genius is in its opening mechanism. In the middle of the night when you've just heard your front door kicked in or the sound of glass breaking or, or voices coming down your hallway, you don't have time to fumble with a key that you may not even find. You may drop it. Your fight or flight responses are kicking in. Your pulse rate's going through the roof. You need to get access to your gun now. You don't need to be fishing with a key. You don't need to be forgetting your combination. I can have access to my gun in less than one second with this LockSafe Biometric Safe. All I have to do is roll out of my bed, activate the safe, swipe my fingerprint, and in less than one second, I have access to my gun. You saw the lid pop open. All I got to do is reach in and grab my gun. Now I have access to my gun. I'll show you it again. In less than one second, I can have access to my gun. All I have to do is roll out of bed, activate the safe, swipe my fingerprint, opens, and I've got my gun. I'm actually confident enough in this safe that I keep my handgun in here, loaded at condition one, ready to go all the time. You know, my kid can't find my key and become curious. My kid can't look over my shoulder and learn my combination. The only people on earth that can access this safe are whoever fingerprints I program in here. It can hold up to 10 fingerprints. Right now I have it programmed with my two index fingers and my wife's two index fingers. And that's it. We are the only two people that can open this safe. Uh, it's very heavy. It has four pre-drilled holes in it so you can mount it down to the floor to a piece of furniture or whatever. Um, I have one of these in my living room, one of these upstairs in my bedroom. Uh, so no matter where I am in my house, I'm only one second away from accessing my gun. I've recommended this safe to my closest friends and family. Uh, once again, I think this is the best product on the market. This particular model retails for $349.95 from the, uh, the manufacturer's website. Um, there really is no better way to store your handgun. There's documented cases of highly trained police officers that have their gun right here on their hip in a holster, not locked, and in a high stress situation. They cannot retrieve their gun from their holster. I think it's very arrogant of people to assume that in the middle of the night, in a high-stress situation, when your pulse rates through the roof, your fight-or-flight responses are kicking in, your fine motor skills have gone out the window, you're going to be able to locate a key, stick a key in a keyhole, and gain access to your gun, or remember a cipher lock combination and punch that in. I really don't think it's going to happen, and I really think you should take a hard look at yourself and really think if you're going to be able to pull that one off. I would be surprised. Um, I'm a pretty highly trained and experienced person, and I think it would be arrogant of myself to assume that I could do that. That's why I have two of these safes in my home. One second I have access and I will never ever lose my key. Never lose my key, they're always right here. Never forget my combination. That's LockSafe Biometrics and uh, thanks for watching. I've got my shot timer. I set it on delay with a part time of four seconds. I'm gonna see if I can get my gun out of my safe in time 
And maybe you should try this with your gun safe at home as well. Less than four seconds, people. It's that fast. Our houses are protected by the good Lord and a gun. And you might meet them both if you show up here, not welcome, son.